Hello! In this video, I will show you how to navigate and buy items through the Path of Exile Trade website. I will go over uniques, some rare items, and a little bit about how the bulk item exchange works as well. Now, uniques are very simple. You just search for the unique name like Belly of the Beast. Then I just type Belly here in the search uh, uh, field and then search and Belly of the Beast will show up. If I want to find like the highest form of increased maximum percentage life, I can click on this and it will show me highest to lowest and I can then see the prices of them as well. So uniques are pretty straightforward and very easy. Then we have rare items. For example, I want to buy a helmet. And on my helmet, I need life and resists because I'm currently following a guide that suggests I have life resist helmet. So I will go here into the item category and I will put in helmet. I will then go over to the stat filters and this is where you can add certain stats that you want to have on your gear. So I'll put in life and I will go for total maximum life. I then want some resist, so I'll put in res, I'll take the cold res, I'll take some fire, and I'll take some lightning. Now, these things here says min or max. Now, I, for example, want a pretty decent helmet, but nothing too crazy. So I want like maybe a minimum of 70 life, and then I want like 25 cold, 25 fire, and 25 lightning minimum on my helmet. Now, another thing that I also want it to be is that I want it to have decent evasion because I'm playing an evasion build and I need evasion for my defenses. So I'm gonna go over here to the armor filters and I'm also gonna put in like 300 evasion minimum and then I will see, can I find a helmet that is good for me that has life, resists and the evasion that I want. Now, as you can see here, for example, here's a Plague Shelter Silken Hood. The name doesn't really matter, only the stats matters here. It has 70 life. It has even more fire and uh, more cold than I wanted. It has some lightning res as well, uh, the minimum of 25 as I put in, but it has more than all of those. And it has 581 evasion. Now, this is a perfect item for me. I then click Whisper and I then copy the message and I just sent it to the person in game and hopefully they'll respond and I'll be able to buy the item. You can do this when looking for any rare item. If you're, for example, looking for amulet and you want life and you are looking for like 40 fire res because that's what you need to balance out your assists and you want some life. And then you also want some critical strike multiplier maybe. Then you just search for crit. Here it says global critical strike multiplier and you want like maybe 15 of that, you can then look for an amulet that has all these things. It has life, it has the fire ass, it has the global crit multiplier. It's a, it definitely applies to everything. I'm looking for a one-handed axe. I want the axe to have crit chance and attack speed and stuff like that. And I want it to have physical damage. You know, you can do that, but with weapons, there's also another thing that you can do as well. You can look over here at the weapon filters where it says critical strike chance. You can put in certain numbers here as well, like attacks per second, you can have 1.7 and crit chance, I can have seven maybe. Physical DPS, I want this to be a pretty good one. I'm not sure 400 is that good or not, I don't know, but I put like these numbers in. It was too much maybe the attacks per second is too high or the crit chance is too high and i have to lower the numbers oh and here we go i now have a one-handed axe that has 1.81 attacks per second 6.6 percent crit chance and it also has 555 physical dps now these are very high numbers as you can see here by the price of this item but this is basically how you search for different right items on the trade websites now i'm also going to show you how the bulk item exchange work as well a lot of people don't really know this but you can sell bulk items or exchange bulk items a lot faster by using this method now let's say that i have a bunch of alteration orbs that i want to get rid of and uh, I want chaos orbs for them. It then says items I have, I click on alterations and then I want chaos for them. Then I click chaos. I then click search and it will show me prices that people have put into the game that they're willing to pay for alterations. Now here's a person, he's willing to buy 440 alterations and he's willing to pay 50 chaos for it. I then click contact. I click, just left click this 
message here, it will copy it automatically and then I go into the game and I whisper this to the person and hope that he responds. And then I can trade my 404 alterations for 50 chaos. Now there are ways to do this in game that I will not really show right now in this video, but uh, yeah, this is basically how you exchange items on the bulk item exchange. Now there's a lot of different things here as you can see, there's sentinel currency, eldritch currency, you know, tainted currency, delirium orbs and scarabs and there's even maps and cards and everything. There's so many things that you can exchange in bulk if you have them and this is a pretty easy nice way to do it. Thank you very much for watching the video and remember to be an absolute legend by dropping the subscription here on YouTube or also following on Twitch over at twitch.tv slash and I hope that you have a fantastic night or day.